Right guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another F350 video. Sorry we didn't post for almost a month. That's because all the parts that we were there was in back order, but now we have everything, so we are moving on. We got the windshield on and we did go with the original window from Ford. They're like 250 more than other options, but at the end of the day, it's worth it. The radiators are on, <coughs> excuse me. Now I'm gonna put the truck on the towing and take it to a shop to get the frame checked. We don't wanna end up start putting the parts together and then something doesn't match because something was off. That way they're gonna measure everything, check, make sure everything is perfect. If you're not, they know what they're doing. They're gonna fix everything. Other than that, we're moving to our next step. So first time didn't work because the truck's so heavy, put the pressure on the back of the trailer, lifted the truck up and slide it away. Second time I block all the wheels on the trailer, I put bricks on the truck under the wheels and then it went on. But this much it got pushed. Well now the truck is on a trailer, all secured. This thing is squatting a little bit. That's a lot of weight. The wheels are sticking out. It's a little risky, but we gotta send it. So, so far, so good. It's pulling with no problems. Just don't wanna go over 55. Other than that, it's all good. All right, so we did find out that the frame was shift a little bit, which is that the frame right now is getting fixed. Basically, this rails was twisted that way a little bit, but no big deal. The professionals are gonna take care of this truck. After that, uh, to the paint boot. The frame is finally done. They did put the parts together to check the gaps and see if it's good or not. And everything looks really good. Of course, everything is holding in two, three screws but the gaps look perfect everything matches really good now i'm waiting for the tow truck to take this thing to a paint boot all right there he is on the tow ready to go so the truck is here at eugene autos he's gonna do the paint job for us again well i only trust him for now anyways i gotta take everything apart even all the little plastics because this bumper is from a different color truck everything has to be sanded fresh paint all over the mirrors we're gonna go with glass black here match the color so we're gonna get rid of the chrome same thing with the handles all that is gonna be color match no more chrome sorry chrome lovers Sometimes the prices doesn't make sense for me. This is the biggest radiator. It's huge. It goes all the way to the bottom, $600. And now there is another one over there, half of that size. It's seven something. 1,150 for the smallest one. This little piece, more than a thousand bucks. It goes right there. Couldn't find it nowhere. I had the part number, there's nowhere, so I had to buy from the dealer. We do get discount, but still, with the discount, it was more than a thousand bucks. What are you gonna do? I need it, but a lot smaller and a lot more money. Bottom radiator, it's in. I got antifreeze from the dealer. 
Now look at the old one. It's bent. It has some damage right there, right here, but it was leaking from under here. There's like a big hole. The fenders, the hood is gonna stay for a little bit until they're actually ready ready everything is holding in two screws anyways but mirrors needs to come out so another thing i gotta pop the chrome handles you don't have to take the handles off to take the chrome off i'll show you how it's done so you open this handle and maybe get like a little plastic tool but i'll try to do it like that basically open a little bit and that thing just pops out all you're opening is this top and bottom for to clear those little clips one side is done with the front door i'm taking everything off because after this is gonna get painted you're gonna have to blend and match the color uh no blend need on the rear door so just a chrome cap on the handle i'll take this mirror to my shop and take it apart more comfortable over there all right now i gotta jump to the other side and do the same but faster two doors two fenders the hood and front bumper this is what we're gonna paint and everything is ready to go The truck is already painted, clear coat, everything. This thing, beautiful. I'll let it dry till tomorrow. What was painted last night. Bumper, fenders, everything is here. It's all dry and stuff, but I still wanna wait till tomorrow. And then tomorrow we're gonna start assembling this thing. Got the doors on the truck. Mirrors and handles, they used to be chrome. We're gonna complete this truck in the next video, but I can't just walk away without installing at least one handle. Boom, there it goes. So much better than Chrome. Look at that. Right guys, that's a wrap for today's video. We did got a lot done. We finished the frame. We paint the truck, bought all the parts. In the next video, we are gonna put the whole thing together. The video after that, we're gonna complete the whole truck with the lift kit, the wheels. By the way, we did get the wheels. We ordered them. I think in like two, three weeks, they should be here. We went with American Force. Uh, 22 inch wheels with 37 inch tires. So that thing is gonna look like a monster when it's done. 
other than that thank you for watching our videos please don't forget to like share and subscribe find us on instagram it's a custom auto builds and i'll catch you guys later